Coach, the, uh, the Ron Baker skipping the scrimmage in Lawrence story has kind of become legend a little bit. What were your understanding or memories of how that went down? And do you ever find yourself wishing that he had made that trip that day? Well, you know, he's a terrific player. And, and uh, uh, I, I, uh, I have great respect for, for, uh, for how he conducts himself, how he carries himself, and how he plays the game. Uh, um, you know, people make recruiting mistakes all the time, and people get lucky recruiting. They get unlucky recruiting all the time. Uh, I would say that that you know there was a lot of people that made a mistake on on Ron, and we would certainly be one of them uh, uh, that made a mistake because we we were not aware of him in 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 the in the way in which I wish we would have been aware of him because obviously anybody would love to have him in their uniform, but but uh, uh, you know. He, that happens all the time, and, and there's been uh, other cases. Uh, you, you look at arguably as two of the very best guards, and maybe the best set of guards playing on the same team uh, uh, in, in uh, Fred and Ron uh, in America. You know, we're, we're obviously one of them, Wichita State may have been fortunate to get because he still came as a walk on, if I'm not mistaken. And the other one was, was basically, I watched him play. Uh, in an event, and I believe it was in uh, Indianapolis or just outside Indy, and I love Fred, and I just I went to my staff and said, man, who is this guy? He's better than anybody we're recruiting. And he said, coach, he just committed to Wichita State last week. So we were just a little bit late on that too. So, But that happens a lot with recruiting, and, and uh, I'm not as familiar with the story, the legend, uh, as what maybe uh, uh, some others are, but uh, I sure wish we would have had an opportunity to see him and study him more than what we did.